What's going on guys and welcome back to another video. I know it's been a while. Life's been crazy. Um, I'll get into that in a little bit. But we are working in the backyard today. Uh, I've got a nice day. It's only about 40, 45 degrees out. So it's warm enough to be out. Um, and I have a little issue on the farm. Um, so recently I've had my two goats for over a year now. Well, recently, the past week, they've gotten out twice. Now, luckily, they're very social and they know where they belong. And so they haven't gone anywhere. Actually, one time they walked all the way around the house and came in through the front gate into the other Vinston backyard section on their own. And the other time they were just waiting right outside the front. But there are predators around here and there is tons of woods. And so if they wanted to escape and go far away, they could. So I don't want that to happen. So uh, I'm going to flip you guys around and show you kind of what I'm doing um, to fix that and why it's happening. So this is their pen that they've been in for about a year. Um, you'll see they've, it's winter, so most of the grass is gone anyways, but um, it's been plenty. They've kind of grazed it down being winter. But when I put this up a year ago, first off, I'd never really built a fence. So you can see it's not great. It's been functional, but it's not, you know, sturdy for a male, even a pygmy goat are pretty strong. So they have managed to push open. I've just had to put extra posts in, but they'll come over here to like a loose section and they've pushed it up and gone out because the fence isn't tight. Um, so what I am doing, I just put in that fenced in area over there. So I've got a lot more experience putting in fenced in. You guys know I've been working on this section. So I was able to toss them over there into the backyard fenced in section. So I am going to take it off of this gate, take it off of these posts, pull it as tight as I can, and either come straight across here, or if I've got enough fencing, go through the bush and come to here, and then I'm gonna come from here to right there. So they'll get this whole section of added grass, and it'll be a lot sturdier. So let's, let me go ahead and get started on that. All right, so I am working on to go pasture stew. So it was around, this area so what I did was I opened it up right there and just took it straight across over there and then now I'm coming I took it off here and I'm either going to go to that corner or the corner of the chicken coop I haven't decided yet but let me show you guys what I came up with so I really don't have a way to stretch it I don't have a lawnmower or a tension bar or anything like that um, to hook it to right now so I kind of just came up and it's, it's worked out pretty well um, so I've got these clamps and all I've been doing is just putting them on the T-post, cranking them down, and you gotta be careful. It's not quite as efficient, but you can see I can still get a real tight pull with just those clamps. So it's definitely worked out. So if you have a pair of clamps, you can definitely use it. So now I'm just gonna put my clips on and let's see if it holds. I'm out here trying to put this fence up so you have more room and you keep trying to headbutt my clamp. Yeah, you better run away. All right, and here is the finished product. So you can see it's a lot tighter, a lot more rigid all the way around. So hopefully they can't just come through and push this up and get out like they did. So they also have a, they lost this little bit of space right here, but they gained all of this. So my goal is, I'm not sure if, if we're gonna be moving this year. If we decide not to, obviously my plan is to extend the goat pasture some more. Um, but if we, I don't wanna put a ton of effort if I'm moving in the next six months, because then I have to build an all new pasture anyway. So. Um, that's it that so the next thing to do and another video is to upgrade this pen they have torn through it and they have just messed it up and I want to build them a nice goat playground so make sure you guys hit that like button hit that subscribe you guys don't miss that video that video is coming pretty soon hopefully um, I have been out the reason I haven't been posting is because I had a baby um, so she is awesome but it's kept me pretty busy um, and now I'm about to go back to work. So hopefully my goal is two videos at least a month 
Um, plus TikToks every week. Uh, so if you haven't followed me on TikTok, make sure you guys follow me on TikTok. Um, but that's it. Um, and I will see you guys later.